Hey there, friends. It's Pharmacist Michael. What if I told you there's a simple, affordable supplement that might actually extend your life? No hype, just real science. I'm talking about TMG, or trimethylglycine, a compound found in beets, spinach, and even your own body. Some researchers believe it could support healthy aging, protect your heart, and even improve DNA methylation, a process tied to longevity and disease prevention. But is it really a longevity booster or just another trendy molecule getting too much attention? Let's look at what the science actually says and what it means for you. Let's start with the basics. TMG, like I said before, stands for trimethylglycine. And it's exactly what it sounds like. Glycine, your body's simplest amino acid, bound to three methyl groups. These methyl groups make TMG a powerful methyl donor, meaning it helps support biochemical reactions that keep your brain sharp, your liver detoxifying, and your DNA functioning properly. In short, TMG is like a behind-the-scenes technician that keeps the engine of your metabolism running smoothly. Now here's where things get really interesting. Because TMG isn't just another supplement. It's part of a biochemical system that could affect how fast and how well you age. Let's break it down. TMG plays a major role in the methylation cycle, a critical cellular process where methyl groups, those tiny CH3 tags, are transferred to other molecules. This might sound technical, but trust me, it matters. One of TMG's most important jobs is converting homocysteine, a potentially harmful amino acid that builds up in your blood, into methionine, a much more useful compound. Why does that matter? Well, elevated homocysteine has been linked to cardiovascular disease, cognitive decline, vision problems, and even shortened lifespan. By lowering homocysteine, TMG helps reduce inflammation and oxidative stress throughout your body. But the benefits don't stop there. Methionine, the product of that conversion, isn't just recycled waste. Your body uses it to create SAMe, which is crucial for mood and brain health. Glutathione, your body's master antioxidant. And creatine, which is important for muscle energy and brain performance. Studies are beginning to connect the dots. Researchers believe TMG could lower homocysteine, reducing risk of heart attack and stroke, support optimal methylation, which is linked to better emotional balance and sharper thinking, protect your DNA by minimizing damage and encouraging healthy gene expression, enhance cellular repair and detox pathways, which slow the aging process at its core. When we talk about living longer and better, we're really talking about preserving the four pillars of long-term health. Methylation, cardiovascular integrity, cognitive resilience, and cellular detoxification. And guess what? TMG seems to support every one of these systems. That's why so many longevity researchers are paying attention and why this simple molecule might just earn a spot in your long-term wellness stack. So now let's talk about the science, because I know you're not just here for hype. You want to know, does TMG actually work? Here's the truth. We don't yet have a flashy, 20-year clinical trial, proving that TMG makes humans live longer. No headlines like, TMG users live to 120. Not yet. But what we do have is a growing body of research, real studies that offer strong clues about how TMG supports health and potential longevity. First up, a 2020 meta-analysis looked at several controlled studies on TMG supplementation. The takeaway? When taken consistently, especially alongside folate and vitamin B12, TMG significantly lowers homocysteine levels in the blood. That's a big deal. 
Why? Well, high homocysteine is more than just a lap number. It's been independently linked to a two times higher risk of stroke, a greater chance of coronary artery disease, and a notable increase in dementia risk, including Alzheimer's. So when we see TMG helping reduce those levels, we're looking at a potentially powerful way to protect your brain, heart, and vascular system over time. Next, animal research. In studies in mice, TMG supplementation has been shown to improve lipid metabolism, translation, better fat processing, reduce fatty liver accumulation, normalize cholesterol profiles, and in some strains, even extend lifespan. Now, don't get too excited. Mice are not many humans. Just because it works in a mouse doesn't guarantee it'll have the same effect in us. But these findings give us important clues about how TMG influences energy use, liver function, and cellular stress. Symptoms that matter deeply in aging. And then there's the epigenic angle. Some of the most cutting-edge researchers in longevity science are focusing on biological age, how old your cells are, not just your birth certificate. They've found that optimized methylation patterns, something TMG helps maintain, are linked to slower telomere shortening, those protective caps on your DNA, fewer epigenic errors that lead to cellular aging, and more stable gene expression especially in the brain and immune system. In other words, methyl donors like TMG might be helping your body write cleaner code as you age, keeping essential cellular function sharp and reducing the risk of chronic disease. So, is TMG a miracle longevity pill? Not quite, but is it a foundational support? Something that keeps your biochemistry humming and your risk factors in check? Absolutely. This is about health span, not just how long you live, but how well you live. And TMG might just be one of those quiet helpers working behind the scenes to support systems you don't always feel until they start breaking down. All right, so what's the catch? Because let's be honest, no supplement is perfect, and TMG is no exception. For most people, TMG is safe and well tolerated, especially in daily doses ranging from 500 mg to 3000 mg. That's the sweet spot used in most clinical studies. But just because something is natural doesn't mean it's completely risk free. Let's go over the most common concerns so you know what to look out for. First up, LDL cholesterol. Some studies and anecdotal reports have shown that high doses of TMG, especially over 3 grams a day, can cause a slight increase in LDL cholesterol. Now, that isn't a universal effect, but it's something to keep an eye on, especially if you already have a history of high cholesterol or cardiovascular disease. If you're taking TMG long term, consider checking your lipid panel regularly to make sure your heart health is staying on track. Next, Gastrointestinal side effects. TMG is an osmolite, which means it pulls water into cells and tissues. That's part of how it supports cellular hydration and detox. But for some people, especially in high doses, it can cause bloating, stomach cramps, or even loose stools or diarrhea. If you're sensitive, starting with a lower dose and gradually increasing can help minimize those side effects. Taking it with food may also reduce GI discomfort. And then there's overmethylation. This one's a bit more nuanced. TMG donates methyl groups which support a healthy methylation cycle. But too much methylation, especially when stacked with other methyl donors like methylfolate or methylcobalamin, B12, can push your system into overdrive. Overmethylation can cause symptoms like irritability or mood swings anxiety or restlessness, insomnia or trouble falling asleep, or a rapid heart rate, which leads to a wired but tired feeling. The key here is balance. If you start feeling off while taking TMG, especially if you've added other methyl donors, consider lowering your dose 
or spacing them out throughout the day. Now let's talk genetics. TMG interacts with your methylation genes, most notably the MTHFR gene. If you have an MTHFR mutation, TMG might be especially helpful since your body may struggle to process folate and recycle homocysteine. But again, this is highly individualized. People with MTHFR variants often respond differently to supplements like folate, B12, and TMG. Some thrive on it. Others need careful titration. If you've done genetic testing and know you're an MTHFR carrier, it may be wise to start low and go slow. Work with a qualified practitioner or monitor homocysteine and methylation markers via lab work. So, to sum it up, TMG is generally safe and effective for most people, but high doses or genetic sensitivities can trigger side effects. And like with any supplement, personalization is everything. Your body's chemistry is unique. And when it comes to methylation, more isn't always better. If you're thinking about using TMG as part of a healthy aging routine, here's what I'd recommend. Start low, 500 to 750 milligrams per day. Pair it with cofactors like methylated B12, folate, and B6. Test your homocysteine before and after starting. Listen to your body. Adjust your dose based on mood, sleep, and gut symptoms. And cycle if needed. Consider 8 to 12 weeks on, followed by a break, and most importantly, make it part of a bigger picture of longevity. Supplements help, but diet, movement, sleep, and stress reduction are where the real magic happens. So, can TMG actually extend your life? The honest answer? We don't have a definitive yes. There's no magic bullet, no secret supplement that guarantees you'll live to 110 dancing around your kitchen with perfect memory and cholesterol levels. But here's what we do know. TMG plays a powerful role in systems that tend to quietly decline as we age. Methylation, inflammation control, cellular repair. It's not flashy, but it's foundational. Let me share a quick story with you. A patient of mine, we'll call him Mark, came to me a few years ago. Mid-50s, busy career, decent shape, but just tired. Foggy thinking, sluggish mornings. And his labs? Homocysteine was creeping up. Liver enzymes a little high, no major disease. Just a body showing early signs of wear and tear. He started taking TMG, nothing crazy, just a thousand milligrams a day with his doctor's blessing, of course. He also added in a methylated B complex and made a few small lifestyle tweaks. Three months later, his energy improved, brain fog lifted, his homocysteine dropped from 14 to 8. Was it just a TMG? Maybe not, but it seemed to unlock something, supporting his system in a way that made other changes work better. That's the thing about TMG. It's not a superstar that steals the spotlight. It's more like the unsung hero behind the scenes, making sure everything else in your orchestra plays in tune. So, could it add years to your life? Maybe. But what excites me even more is the potential to add life to your years. More energy, sharper thinking, fewer aches, better aging on a cellular level. That sounds like a solid definition of health span to me. If you're curious about TMG, give it a thoughtful try. Just remember, start low, go slow, and always listen to your body. If something doesn't feel right, pause and reassess. And as always, this isn't about chasing longevity with blinders on. It's about building a solid foundation, one small, smart choice at a time. Because when it comes to aging well, it's not about living forever. It's about feeling good for as long as you can. If this video helped you learn something new, give it a thumbs up and share it with a friend who's always looking for ways to optimize their health. And tell me in the comments, have you ever tried TMG? What benefits or side effects did you notice? Make sure to subscribe for more science-backed videos on supplements 
medications, and the best ways to stay healthy naturally. And be sure to check out the description section of this video where you can see products I recommend to help you live a better life. My name is Pharmacist Michael, and I'll see you in the next video.